We're going to check in on our weather. Fortunately, we don't have that kind of stuff going on, but you're telling me there may be a few windy conditions around. Yeah, it looks like the winds are really going to ramp up tomorrow, Vic. Uh, they were pretty strong this afternoon, but they're going to get even higher tomorrow afternoon across the region. We do have a wind advisory that's expanded to now include Baltimore County and Baltimore City. Let's get right to your forecast that we're tracking some rain tonight. You thought we were finished with it, but not quite yet. We are tracking some more showers just off to our north. And uh, these are going to continue swinging their way through the region. I think the best chances are going to be areas north of Baltimore. So that would include northeast Maryland, Cecil, and Harford County, down into sections of Kent County. So, again, for tonight, just some light showers. But then as we go throughout the day tomorrow, sunshine should build back in. But it is going to be windy, particularly during the second half of the day. Uh, but it looks like sunshine and 70s make their way back into the region on Sunday. So even though it'll be a little breezy on Sunday, it looks like we'll see more sunshine and warmer temperatures. Low 40s out towards McHenry right now. Uh, that's some colder air that's coming in behind another cold front. Uh, but temperatures primarily in the mid to upper 50s here. So again, it looks like as we go through tonight, those winds are going to continue gusting. We still have a west wind now at about uh, 25 to 35 miles an hour, but they're going to get even stronger tomorrow afternoon. This goes through Saturday evening. They've expanded it eastward to include areas along and west of I-95, where we could see some gusts up to 50 tomorrow. Make sure you secure all those loose objects out there. So again, we got an area of low pressure spinning around just off to our north. These are the showers that we're dealing with now. They will gradually move out. Skies will clear out, and it looks like, again, the winds will be the bigger story for tomorrow, as those winds are going to be gusting tomorrow morning and tomorrow afternoon. 30 to 35 miles an hour, then 40 to 45, maybe even up to 50 into the afternoon. Again, that's going to be the area that has the strongest winds. So will be right around that 9 a.m. to, I'd say, 5, 6 p.m. time frame. And then when the winds should begin to slacken off a little bit here by tomorrow night. Overall, though, for the entire state, forecast looks pretty good. 50s out in far western Maryland in the higher elevations, but everybody else will be primarily into the low to mid 60s. First alert, seven day forecast. As promised, we got 70s on tap for Sunday. Chance for rain that will increase Sunday night, Monday morning as a front drops into the area. And then we're going to be tracking more rain for the middle part of the week. But temperatures next week, fairly mild. Highs in the mid to even upper 70s with lows at night, 50s and 60s. Back to you.